Hi, my name is Amber. I'm from Worcester. I play with a band called Sapling and I am a therapist. <laughs> Theremin is the only instrument in the world that you play without touching. How does that work? Simple. Electricity. Electromagnetic fields. Sounds complicated? Really not. Each antenna has its own electric field, which responds to your body. Now, we have two antennas here. We have our pitch antenna, which controls the different notes that we play, and we have the volume antenna. Which controls how loud we get. Now the theremin is the first electronic instrument developed in the 1920s by accident by a man named Leon Theremin, who was trying to measure gas. The first Virtuoso of the instrument was a woman I very much admired when I was younger uh, by the name of Clara Rockmore. Now, as much as I appreciated Clara Rockmore, I do have to disagree with one major philosophy of hers, which is when you play the theremin, you have to be very still and very removed emotionally and stone cold like a statue. I find myself enjoying the theremin the most when I am playing with Reckless Abandon. Now there are a lot of things that I use to manipulate the sound of my theremin. I'm always looking for a, a new thing to try. I'm always trying to push the new different sounds that I can mix and match and create. So today with my theremin, I am using a number of effects pedals. synthesizer via CV. Underneath your theremin, you find your CV, or your control voltage. You have one for the gate, the pitch, and the volume. Now what you do is you plug an instrument cable into each one and then you plug the other end of the cable into the corresponding CV on whatever other instrument or electronic device you are using. Then audio out of that device back into your amplifier. So any instrument with matching control voltages can be paired with another instrument that has CV controls and you can use your theremin to play that instrument. Really neat. Now, CV is something that I don't see a lot of people using their theremins for, but mine had CV inputs, so I said, why not? And I started plugging into anything that I could think of. Now one thing that I learned is that not all instruments have the same control voltage rating. So when I first plug started plugging my theremin into the synthesizers, I started hearing a very high pitch. <laughs> noise like that, and that's all I could get out of it. I think the theremin speaks to me as an instrument because it is so different. And I like the idea of not 
needing perfection 100% of the time. When I was a kid, I wanted to be a Foley, which is someone who makes all the noises that you hear in your TV shows and cartoons. I always wanted to score some films, black and white films and silent film scoring. I love sci-fi and horror. With a the theremin, there's a little bit more room to experiment and get kind of wacky with. 